Hello everybody and welcome to the Talladega Super Speedway here for the Truck Series Chase Race here at Dega. On your pole we have Tommy Tang in the 51 followed by AJ Jones, two chasers. Um, hang on a second. Let me... Hmm. Hold on, I'm trying to double check something. Did I delete? Hang on. Okay, yeah. So, Tommy Tang and um, AJ Jones on your front row. And then we have Cody Smart in the 19, another chaser, followed by James Kinghart. Corey Roberts, another chaser. Behind, beside him, another chaser, John Gilbert. And we have um, John Buford, Mike Jones, another chaser. He is um, safe to go into the round of six. Um, then we have Eli Bright and Andy Smith. Here's the rest of his starting lineup. On your final rows, we have Jordan Fisher replacing the injured Nick Smith and Daniel Royals. So, that was your starting lineup. Um, so, only six out of the eight chase drivers will be able to move on to the next round of six. Um, last week when Mike Jones won, I believe I made a mistake saying he'd get to go in the championship round. Um, not exactly, not exactly, because we still have Texas, um, Martinsville, and Phoenix then the um, championship round so the top six drivers to finish in this race will move on to the next round so let's get you down the track side for the commands drivers start your engines there was the commands and the engines are fired so like I said, top six moves on to the next round. The 13 is blowing his engine. And that's Mike Jones in the 13, last week's winner. He is safe to move on to the next round, so he doesn't have to worry. But still tough luck for that team right there. Because their engine just took fire before they even got to start. Careful. Oh, no. And James Bowles just got into the back of Nevins after this. And the 59 right there may be a little bit slow, depends on how much that damage was. But a pace truck has pulled down pit road. Tommy Tang, AJ Jones, he made Chevys on the front, or not Chevy, Toyota starting on the front row. Green flag is out at Talladega. And already caution is out here on lap one. The 17 of Evan Rudd, a chaser, was involved in that one right there. I believe Evan Rudd is actually safe. We make one lap one. Yeah, Evan Rudd is safe. He won. He won. Um, out it. And it's coming down. It's three wide at the line for the lead. Oh, we have more drivers involved. A lot of drivers involved in that one. As it's Mike, it's AJ Jones in the four that will lead them under the yellow. So, looks like things got really crazy here early on. Make sure everyone's okay. All five is on something. So, let's get you look at the replay. So here's a look at what happened. Oh, okay. Wrong place then, I guess. This is where it all started right here. So, there were four wide here already on the start of the race. Oh, the two in, of Malik Nevins he gets into the 17. He goes up on his side. James Bowles has some damage right there. Then it's 71 of Ramian Fisher went around up there. 
Let's see, Fisher saw the wreck. He went down into the apron as low as he can, just trying to avoid a wreck here. And came up on Philip Goldberg. Goes up, gets into, oh, Goldberg goes hard into the wall, gets into the 33 right there. Comes down on Nate Smith. And James Bowles just, or no, Jordan Fisher just getting clipped at the last second. Right there, James Bowles ran into the Fisher. Daniel Bowles also went around. Heavy contact with Malik Nevins right there. As that was your first caution of the day. Pretty big wreck right there. Nate Smith getting even more damage. Let's get you back to the restart. Pace truck has pulled down pit road. There's the drivers out of the race. Two of them already have a win. That's in the chase. That's 17. And the 13 who didn't start the race. So those two already have a win. They don't even have to worry. So like I said, the top six only chasers in this race get to move on to the next round. It's AJ Jones getting help from his teammate Tommy Tang in the 51. This here comes the 19. That's uh, John Gilbert. Or no, the 29. That's John Gilbert. So as they run right now, eliminated would have been if this was a finish, Zachary Pitts would have seen you would have been eliminated. And Cody Smart would have been eliminated. So those guys need to hope something happens so sure so they can get a bump. It's tiny tiny speed right now. Wait, where did the four go? Oh there's a four. J Jones, he fell back a bit. Goes back down to the inside. Fly by the seal here. Um, Buford in the 07 trying to block all these things. Goes down, he takes the inside. Right there is uh, charging AJ Jones and Eric Monaco in the 18. Richardson also right there. As these guys are pushing each other. Is um, Buford continues to block. It's pretty good here on these super speedway. Remember, we let most laps out of Daytona, but uh, she might have brought that for him. Is there were four or five wide right there at the line? I can't even tell. There are four wide there at the line. Is Cody Smart right there? Is in the middle. See, he made his way up here, trying not to get eliminated. Don't clip the 18. Four is going to fall back right there. AJ Jones. As we have three laps of racing remaining here. Oh, and there they go. And around goes Cody Smart and others. The 51, Tommy Tane. Two chasers involved in that right there. Hard into the wall goes, I um, believe that's the 43. As you're gonna race it back to the line, John Buford, Jim Smith. As this here is for the win. And it's gonna be the 07 of John Buford to lead him back to the line. Cody Smart went around super fast right there. This is not a good sign for him. But caution is out for the second final time it seems. John Buford is the leader. Let's get a look at the replay. So here's a look at what happened. Watch that orange truck right there. Him and Cody Smart was making contact. And um, yeah, he goes down into Smart right there. There were four wide, gets into the 18 of Monaco. Monaco then gets turned into Smart. If yeah, AI could go airborne, I'm pretty sure the 18 would have went airborne right there. Everyone's scrambling, trying to get out of this uh, 19, 51. Both chasers have heavy damage. See Monaco go up into the outside wall right there. Then Tommy Tang, he, um, heavy that he got stuck on the apron, I think. Man, here's another look at it right here. Yeah, he makes contact with the 19. Goes around and gets turned. Yeah, he definitely would have won airborne too. If I wish the AI could go airborne so bad, that would have been cool. Um, yeah, two chasers who doesn't have a win from the past two races involved in this one. That's Cody Smart and um, Tommy Tang. We'll get you back to the um, finish here and see what happens.
Getting ready for the finish here. Matthew and Gilram in the 44 stayed out. Those guys pitted. They were not able to um, um, make it on fuel. As Matthew and Gilram in the 44 is going to get career win number one here at Talladega. What a shocking turn of events right there. Didn't expect him to win, but he stayed out. And he gets his first career win, It'll, and it will, it will come here at Talladega. And the top six drivers to move on, or, or hold on, no, the top, let's see, two drivers are already locked in. That's 17 and the, the 13, so that's two. So the top four drivers, I meant to say, gets locked into the next round. And um, let's see here. So locked into the next round of six. Corey Roberts is in. AJ Jones is in. Zachary Fitzwater Senior is in, and Cody Smart is in. He becomes the last truck to uh, make it in here. Takes. So Cody Smart um, gets into the chase here and missing the chase is John Gilbert in the 29. Was not gonna make it on fuel. Ended up hitting and Cody Smart, I, he just got really, really lucky right there. So eliminated from the chase is John is um John Gilbert and Tommy Tang. They will not be competing for the championship no longer. Here's a full race results. Matthew Engelram wins here at Talladega. Paul Minnick second. Brian Lanning third. Corey Roberts fourth. James Kinghart fifth. AJ Jones sixth. Japan Takio Vernio seventh. Bali Sporty Cube eighth. Henry Williams ninth. And uh, Shelby Smith runs out to top ten. Here's a finishing results. Only one car finished lap down. That was 51. So um, let's go over this again. The 17th, um, the 30, the no, 13 didn't start the race, but he won last week, so he was already locked into the round of six. The 17 won Loudon, he's already locked in. Um, then the top finishers in the chase: Corey Roberts, AJ Jones, Zachary Fitzwater Sr., and Cody Smart. So yes, that is right. Cody Smart becomes the last driver to make it in the, here in the chase. So without further ado, let's get you down to victory lane where Matthew and Goram celebrates. Good job, Carl. Good job. Nice driving. Great job, guys. Unbelievable. 